East Los Angeles mother was charged today with killing her three young children. The youngest was less than two months old. Eyewitness News reporter Sid Garcia is live at the courthouse in downtown Los Angeles. Sid. Sandra Chico was charged today on three counts of murder. As you said, she made her first court appearance earlier today, but did not enter a plea. Her arraignment has been postponed until the middle of July, but the judge did raise her bail from $2 million to $6 million. Cameras were not allowed in court for her first appearance before a judge. 28-year-old Sandra Chico was charged with three counts of murder. The victims, her three small children, four-year-old Mia Rodriguez, her three-year-old brother Mason Rodriguez, and their baby brother Milan Rodriguez, who was just under two months old. Sheriff's deputies responded to the mother's East Los Angeles home Monday afternoon just before one. The children were pronounced dead. Sheriff's investigators aren't saying how they were killed. Yesterday, L.A. County Sheriff Alex Villanueva said there were no signs of trouble at the family home. There was no uh, forewarning of any kind. There was no repeated calls for service. DCFS was not involved. There was no allegations of child abuse. This was out of the blue tragedy. Last night, a candlelight vigil was held at the family home. Some of Sandra Chico's relatives came out and asked people not to pass judgment over the 28-year-old mother, adding she has been dealing with some mental health issues. A lot of people saying that they're misjudging my, my sister-in-law. They're telling her that she was a bad mother. But only thing I ask is don't judge. I know it's hard, but don't judge. Sandra Chico is due back in court on July 21st. Again, the judge today raising her bail from $2 million to $6 million. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.